one of the hazards of sleeping with the windows open when the weather's nice is that uh, whatever's outside the window making noise you can hear really good So, how is my uh, new way of eating going, you might be asking? Well, here's my cup of broth that I have every morning. This, is, this happens to be chicken broth with ghee in it. So here's the deal. Every morning, a cup of chicken broth. Uh, and then, uh, I think I told you in that other video, a, a lunch, usually a salad. I try to eat the salad. And then for dinner, uh, protein and vegetables so that's it uh, and it's interesting yesterday um, I consider that two meals a day because I don't consider broth a real meal yesterday I had a, we I had a, a, a cup of broth we went out uh, exploring and and uh, around around uh, about an hour from here I got back about 1 30 I forgot to eat and it was about 3 3 30 when I decided, uh, oh, I forgot to eat uh, lunch, so I ran and got a couple of hamburger patties cooked down at the deli, and that's all I had. And then for dinner, what did I have for dinner? I don't think I had anything for dinner. So um, you're just not hungry uh, eating like this. It, it, it's great. Well, Frida's gone. Uh, she was out, She went on a little uh, road trip on her own uh, with a friend. And uh, so me and my dad are left to our own devices for a day and uh, wanted to clean the racks on the, uh, on the grill. That would be a good idea to put them in the oven. It may not have been a good decision. So I just left my dad in the house, uh, come out here to the office, upload some videos. And I said, hey dad, come on, we've got to go do something today. Um, and this is why I wish you just rolling all the time with the camera. Um, he sits and he's in his chair and he looks at me and he says, he says, well, hell, what do you mean do something? All you do is walk around and talk to yourself in a, at a camera <laughs> like, like a retard. <laughs> Today is Memorial Day weekend and me and Bumps are once again out and about a little bit going down the road to Abington. Kind of a, I guess there's a lot of Civil War stuff happening there, right? Oh yeah, one of the earlier towns in uh, Virginia. So, uh, we'll see what we can, uh, see what trouble we can get into. The now hotel is a uh, Confederate hospital. So, do you consider yourself a Union man or a... Uh, Confederate. I'm a union person. He's a union guy. See, I, I consider like my... my grandfather was. Oh, really? I, I thought we were, I thought we were a long line of Confederates. Well, that hung us years ago. <laughs> well, maybe I kind of consider myself a Confederate today. What's with these turn lanes? They uh, fake you out. Not gonna get over there? Yeah, not gonna get over there. Where's that hotel you were talking about? Just down here. Martha Washington, that's the name of it. The Martha Washington Hotel? Yeah. There's the Burger Theater on the left. Here's the, most here's the, here's the Martha Washington right here. Better hospital. Shoot barter. Now, what's the significance of the barter? Yeah. 
you know, every year, um, my wife's family uh, has a tradition of going to the Phoenix Cemetery where they have uh, their people buried. Uh, a few of them died in the wars and uh, whatnot on Memorial Weekend. They, they head over there, so I'm nowhere near Phoenix, but uh, uh, I just thought, hey, keep up the tradition. So you saw, you saw me eat that broth this morning, and that is all I've had uh, until now. It is, it is, I don't know, what time is it, Dad? I don't know. He don't know, but it's in the afternoon. Where'd that Subway go? And I'm gonna go get a salad at Subway. It's my new favorite, uh, my new favorite thing. Kind of like, kind of like going to Waffle House only. It's better don't ever leave your windows open in the morning if you want to sleep in living next to a bunch of crows bad news Apparently my food consumption is exceeding my uh, worth here, so I have to mow the lawn. <laughs> <laughs> and let me just tell you... He, he doesn't if, know how to mow, I don't think. I don't, but uh, let me just tell you something. If you can't mow it, you don't need to own it. I'm just saying. There you go. Yeah. That's a lot of grass. Oh, you just got started. <laughs> I know. This is, is just the front yard. What are you talking about a lot of grass? <laughs> that is a lot of grass. <laughs> You can do it. I can do it. <laughs> Javi will get him. He's been doing wheelies and going around in circles and Javi goes one way and then carefully turns and goes back the next way. <laughs> he's doing a good job. I'm happy he's doing it. That means I don't have to do it. Hey, how do I smell by the way? Good. You smell like grass. What kind of grass? <laughs> the good grass. Okay. <laughs> quite have it all figured out yet. <laughs> <laughs> 